the mixture of almonds and raisins. One easy method to separate them is through hand picking. Both almonds and raisins are different in terms of their shapes and colors as well as their texture. We simply need to pick it up and place them separately. See, it is very easy to separate them. This is the mixture of flour and paper clips. One easy way to separate them is through magnet. Magnetic attraction is used to separate materials that can be attracted by a magnet. The clips are separated from the flour. This is the mixture of black pepper and flour. The best method to separate them is through sieving. It is because you are trying to separate fine sized material and large sized material. For sieving we need to use the sieve. As you can see, the pepper is already separated from the flour. This is the mixture of crushed tea leaves and water. The best way to separate them is through filtration. This is because one of the substance is heavier than the other. For filtration, we need to use the filter. Look, the tea leaves remain in the filter. This is the mixture of water and leaves. The best way to separate them is through flotation. This is because flotation is used to separate materials that can float from materials that sink. Just use anything to pick up the floating object. The leaf has been taken out of the water.